So, here we are at the uh, mower. I want to show you guys something. Um, I don't like how much grass the mower is leaving. And so, there's an adjustment. It doesn't go up and down like this. It goes down all the way and then the, and then the whole the whole head will pitch down and up and that's your that's your height that you get. So the further down you go, the lower the ground gets and then the higher up you go, the taller you leave it. There are different reasons for leaving grass or taking grass depending on what kind of grass you have and what you're trying to do. So for this mower the adjustment for it is this arm right here. It's got that little uh, little thing sticking off so you can just do it by hand. So Loosen this guy right here, like that, and then you spin this around. Spin this around. This adjusts the, basically the pitch at which the mower cuts down into the grass. You know, the blades there. The more we pitch it down, the more it cuts. See there, so that's that's about the height that we're gonna get, which isn't totally accurate because of how we're sitting right now on this hill where it's parked. But anyway, this is not it's not enough. I want it to pitch down more, and so this bar is already fully extended. It won't go down, won't extend anymore. So as I was raking, I was thinking about how it might be possible to either get. I just realized I might have one of these bars just exactly like this but a little bit longer. So we use a bar like this, get one longer or just simply take this apart here and just get a plate with holes in it and just, just reattach it back here. Just add two inches to it. Then I can short it up and then have that because I'll never hardly want it any higher than I want it now, the grass. I want it, this is the longest and then I want it to go a lot shorter. So if I'm going to try cutting again where I've already cut earlier I want to get a lot more grass out of the deal. So um, I'm going to take this over to the shop later and we're going to see about extending that or getting a different one on there or something. So just one of those things to uh, try to do a better job. It's just not picking up the grass off the ground enough. There's a lot of kind of heavy grass that laid over that if you stood it up would be, you know, six, seven inches tall. Uh, and so that's kind of a lot of tonnage that I end up leaving in the field. So I'm doing the cutting, I'm doing the raking, but you know there's a lot of grass left in the field. And uh, and I want to I want to see if I can do another cutting after this one too. So um, yeah, cool. We'll take a break and then uh, we'll go check the hay. All right, got the uh, tractor hooked up to the mower. It's all greased and ready to go. I sprayed essential lube all over the non-greased zerks. Tightened up a bolt here and. Uh, that moving that shackle and adjusting that thing is not going to be as easy as I thought. Not a project for today. We'll worry about that maybe later. Um, but it is maxed out, so I have all of it in. Um, yeah, other than that, looking good. I got my new little PTO hanger here. This has been a huge nightmare when you're hooking and unhooking this thing. And now I got a PTO I can take and hang this on there so I can get my pin in and out. So awesome. All right, let's go cut some hay. Session's done. 
<sighs> All right. That section's done. I'll cut the I'll cut the next section next to it tomorrow morning first thing, uh, and then not first thing like start at like ten, and then uh, probably like three or four hours on that, and then I'll bail. The uh, we're gonna bail start bailing what I raked uh, first thing today. So uh, super exciting. That's it for now. Thanks for stopping by. We'll uh, we'll do some bailing tomorrow and we're cutting tomorrow and bailing tomorrow. And then we gotta use the uh, gotta use the hay grapple and start putting stuff away in the barn. I'm gonna do some spray foam along that first before we get that done. So, all right, we're gonna go home and make game plan, and uh, we'll see we'll see how it goes. You guys have a great night. Thanks for stopping by.